Hello everybody and welcome to my e-listen. This is a personality development class and in this I'll be telling you about 30 things that you should stop doing towards becoming a successful person. First one, stop spending time with the wrong people. Life is too short to spend time with people who suck the happiness out of you. If someone wants you in their life, they will make room for you. You shouldn't have to fight for a spot. Never ever insist, your, insist yourself to someone who continuously overlooks your worth. And remember, it's not the people that stand by your side when you are at your best, but the ones who stand beside you when you are at your worst. That are the true friends. Stop running from your problems. You should raise them head on. It won't be easy. There is no person in the world capable of flawlessly handling every punch thrown at them. We don't supposed to be able to instantly solve problems. That's now how we are made. In fact, we are made to get upset, sad, hurt, stumble and fall because that's the whole purpose of living to face problems learn adapt solve them over the course of time this is what ultimately molds us into the person we become so let's start facing our problems right now stop lying to yourself you can lie to anyone else in the world but you can't lie to yourself our lives improve only when we take chances. The first and the most difficult chance we can take is to be honest with ourselves. If we are not honest with ourselves, then maybe we are living in a fool's paradise. Stop putting your own needs on the back burner. The most painful thing is losing yourself in the process of loving someone too much and forgetting that you are special too. Yes, help others, but help yourself too. If there's, there was ever a moment to follow your passion or do something that matters to you, that moment is now. Do something that you love. Stry, stop trying to be someone you are not. One of the greatest challenges in life is being yourself in a world that is trying to make you like everyone else. Someone will always be prettier. Someone will always be smarter. Someone will always be younger, but they will never be you. Don't change so people will like you. Be yourself and the real people will love the real you. Stop trying to hold on to the past. You can't start the next chapter of your life if you keep rereading the last one. Let go of what has happened. Be in the present. Be in the present. Stop being scared to make a mistake. Doing something and getting it wrong is at least 10 times more productive than doing nothing. Every success has a trail of failures behind it and every failure is leading towards success. You end up regretting the things you did not do far more than things you did. So start doing something. No problems if you end up making a mistake. I'm sure next time you would improve upon it. Stop berating yourself for old mistakes. We may love the wrong person and cry about wrong things. But no matter how things go wrong, one thing is for sure. Mistakes help us find the person and things that are right for us. Right? We all make mistakes, have struggles and even regret things in our past. But you are not your mistakes. You are not your struggles. You are here now with the powers to shape your day and your future. 
every single thing that has ever happened in your life is preparing you for a moment that is yet to come. Start defining that moment now. Stop trying to buy happiness. Many of the things we desire are expensive. But the truth is, the things that really satisfy us are totally free. Love, laughter, working on our own passions. You may end up buying a beautiful, uh, the most jazzy, latest phone. But tell me, would it truly, truly make you happy? Think. What would make you happy would be love, laughter, and working on something you love about, you're passionate about. Stop exclusively looking to others for happiness. If you're not happy with who you are on the inside, you won't be happy in a long-term relationship with anyone else either. You have to create stability in your own life first before you can share it with someone else. Be happy with yourself. You'll be happy with the world. Stop being idle. Don't think too much or you will create a problem that wasn't there in the even in the first place. Evaluate situations and take decisive action. You cannot change what you refuse to confront. Making pro progress involves risk, period. You can't make it to second base with your foot on first. Stop thinking you are not ready. This is a problem I believe most of the people face. Nobody ever feels 100% ready when an opportunity arises. Because most great opportunities in life force us to grow beyond our comfort zones. Which means we won't feel totally comfortable at first. So never wait. Take things head on. Stop getting involved in relationships for the wrong reasons. Relationships must be chosen wisely. It's better to be alone than to be in bad company. There's no need to rush. If someone, if something is meant to be, it will happen in the right time with the right person and for the best reason. Fall in love when you're ready, not when you're lonely. Stop rejecting new relationships just because old ones didn't work out. In life, you will realize that there is a purpose for everyone you meet. Some will test you, some will use you and some will teach you. But most importantly, some will bring out the best in you. So that is what we should be looking at. Stop trying to compete against everyone else. Don't worry about what, other, what others are doing better than you. Concentrate on beating your own records every day. Success is a battle between you and yourself only. Set very high standards for yourself. Stop being jealous of others. Jealousy is the art of counting someone else's blessings instead of your own. Ask yourself this. What's something I have that everyone wants? You'll see the answer. Stop complaining and feeling sorry for yourself. Life's curveballs are thrown for a reason. To shift your path in a direction that is meant for you. Life throws challenges at you. There's a reason for it. They want to actually shift you in a direction that would lead you to your destiny. You may not see or understand everything that moment it happens. It may be tough. But reflect back on those negative situations that happened to you in the past. You will often see that eventually they led you to a better place, or to being a better person and being at a better state of mind or a situation. So smile. Let everyone know that today 
you are a lot stronger than you were yesterday and you will be. Stop holding grudges. Don't live your life with hate in your heart. You will end up hurting yourself more than the people you hate. Forgiveness is not saying what you did to me is okay. It is saying I am not going to let what you did to me ruin my happiness forever. Forgiveness is the answer. Let go. Find peace. Liberate yourself. And remember, forgiveness is not just for other people. It is for you too. You must forgive yourself. Move on. Try to do better next time. Stop letting other people, others, bring you down to their level. Their level. Refuse to lower your standards to accommodate those who refuse to raise theirs. You would automatically be perceived as a leader, as a visionary, as a person of really, really high standards. So I'll repeat, this is very important. Refuse to lower your standards to accommodate those who refuse to raise theirs. <clears throat> Stop wasting time explaining yourself to others. Your friends don't need it. Your enemies won't believe it anyway. Just do what you know and your heart is right. Stop doing the same things over and over without taking a break. Happens to most of us most of the time. The time to take a deep breath is when you don't have time for it. If you keep doing what you're doing, you'll keep getting what you're getting. Sometimes you need to distance yourself from what you're doing to see things more clearly. Stop overlooking the beauty of small moments. Enjoy the little things because one day you may look back and discover they were the big things. The best portion of your life will be small, nameless moment you spend smiling with someone who matters to you. Stop trying to make things perfect. This is very, very thought provoking. The real world doesn't reward perfectionists. It rewards people who get things done because the world is not perfect, my friend. The real world doesn't reward perfectionists. It rewards people who get things done. So start getting things done now. Stop following the path of least resistance. Life is not easy. Especially when you plan on achieving something worthwhile. Don't take the easy way out. Do something extraordinary. Stop acting like everything is fine if it isn't. It's okay to fall apart a little while. You don't always have to pretend to be strong. There is no need to constantly prove that everything is going well. You shouldn't be concerned with what other people are thinking either. Cry if you need to. It's healthy to shed your tears. The sooner you do, the sooner you will be able to smile again. Stop blaming others for your troubles. The extent to which you can achieve your dreams depend on the extent to which you can take responsibility for your own life. When you blame others for what you are going through, you deny responsibility. You give others power over that part of your life so stop blaming others for your trouble look inwards stop trying to be everything to everyone doing so is impossible trying will only burn you out but making one person's smile can change the world maybe not the whole world but their world so narrow your focus we cannot be everything to everyone let us be ourselves Stop worrying so much. Worrying will not strip tomorrow of its burdens. It will strip today of its, of its joy. One way to check if something is worth mulling over is to ask yourself this question. Will this matter in a year's time? Three years, five years? 
If not, then this is not worth worrying about. Don't worry about a problem. Think of a solution. Stop focusing on what you don't want to happen. Focus on what you want, what you do want to happen. Positive thinking is at the forefront of every great success story. If you awake every morning with the thought that something wonderful will happen to you in your life today and you place pay close attention, you will often find that you're right. This is the law of attraction at work. Stop being ungrateful. No matter how good or bad you have it, wake up every day thankful for your life. Someone, someone, someone somewhere else is desperately fighting for theirs. Instead of thinking about what you are missing, try thinking about what you have that everyone else is missing. Let's thank God. Thank you so much. You can view such more lessons on www.myelesson.org. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.